Tartlets, it's Deanna, and in my last vlog, actually it was a couple of vlogs ago, but um, I cut my hair short to be like Julianne Huff. Um, so since then, a lot of you have been asking me to do a short hair tutorial vlog, so you asked for it and here it is. Um, so I'm going to show you guys how I do my hair like every day, and by the way, short hair actually requires a lot more work than you probably think, so let's get started. First of all, you'll probably notice that my hair looks a little crazy right now. Obviously, it's not staying like this. But when I get out of the shower and even after I blow dry my hair, it's kind of crazy. So this is uh, my natural hair. Anyway, I like to start by putting the top part up in a clip. This one is just like a little clip like this. So I hold it up like that. And then all these like crazy pieces down here... I straighten and I'm actually going to straighten my whole head first. Now that my hair is straight, it almost feels a little flat, which is okay for now because I'm going to throw in some of our Hair Goals Dry Shampoo, and this actually helps me with texture too, so it just makes it feel like more voluminous and texturized, which helps when I am using the wand to style it. <laughs> One of the reasons why I love our Hair Goals Dry Shampoo is because it's not formulated with sulfate. And if you don't know, sulfate strips the color of your hair slowly over time. So if you get your hair highlighted like I do or if you dye it, make sure you get something that is sulfate free. And I highly, highly recommend our Hair Goals Dry Shampoo. And now that I've done that, you can already see the volume. You can see that it looks much more texturized. I like to flip it over to one side. It doesn't matter for me. but. Um, yeah, now I'm gonna go ahead and get started with my wand. When I have longer hair, I used a thicker barrel, but now that I have the shorter hair, I go for one that's really um, a lot skinnier. So this one is a half, one and a half. I don't really know, but I'll let you know in the comments down below. I'll write it in the description, because I'm gonna have to look that up after this video. I'm not very good with math, but I'm gonna say that this is probably half inch maybe three-fourths of an inch like I said we'll get back to you I'm gonna stick to the tutorial because that's what I know how to do um, all right so I'm gonna start on this side and I'm just gonna take a little piece of my hair right here and I'm going to wrap it and I like to do it facing away from my face so you're twirling it away from your face if that makes sense hold it there for about five seconds and then release and just brush it out because I don't like it to look too curly. I like it to look more messy and kind of leave like the bottom part like that. So I like to leave the bottom part out so I'm not curling that. So it gives it like that straight end and then just pull it out. And then also you might notice I don't like to curl or wand every single piece. I like some straight pieces some wanded pieces so I'm just gonna go around the head and I am going to just wand some pieces some random pieces and give it some more texture so here's what it looks like after using the wand you can see it's kind of tousled it's a little messy it's not really tight ring like curls this is what I was going for um, and you can also see the straight pieces. That's why I like to do the straightening before I use the wand. Some people might think it's kind of productive, but I kind of like going for that look. So yeah, now I am going to top it off with some hairspray. I'm using the Way Texturizing Hairspray. I love this one, and I also love their soft hairspray. Here is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, it's super easy. It's somewhat quick because you have to straighten your hair and everything, but using the wand is super fast and I pretty much try to do this every single day and let me know if you guys have any suggestions for me with the short hair because I'm new to this game and uh, I'd like to hear what you guys do with short hair. So until next time guys, I'll see you later. Mwah! 
you made it! <laughs> We're so glad you watched the full video because now you get to find out how to win a MacBook Pro. And we've made the rules to enter so easy. All you have to do is make sure you're subscribed to our YouTube channel if you aren't already, but you should be. Um, and then make sure you leave this emoji, this little laptop emoji, down below in the comment section. And then head on over to our Facebook channel. We'll link that down below. And make sure you like us on Facebook and leave the same laptop emoji in the comment section of this video once you head over there. And just so you know, we will be checking to make sure that you do both. That you like us and comment on Facebook and that you subscribe and comment here on YouTube. And this contest is going to run for two weeks, so you have until October 5th. So good luck, Tartlets, and I hope you guys enjoy this, and I'll see you guys next time. Mwah!